Problem number one. It says 2x plus y is equal to 5. x minus y equals 1. It wants us to solve this system. we got to come up with x and y's values that are going to make this equation true and that equation true. Now, I would love it if I could use substitution, and you could. You could maybe get x by itself by moving the y over and then replacing. You'd have 1 minus y here. So if x were equal to 1 minus y, you could plug it in up there. You could do that. But there's a better method in this case called elimination. Whenever you have two equations, you can always add them together or subtract them if you really wanted. But usually what we math teachers are always going to say is always add them together. It saves a lot of problems. I'm not going to talk about that now. But if you add them together, you're going to get a third equation that's true. Now, it's great if I add them together and some one of the variables, somebody cancels out. I'm in great shape. Then I'm just left with one variable and I'll have an answer. Let's see if that happens here. It looks like it will, because if I put together these two equations, a positive y, when I add it to a negative y, is going to cancel out, and I'll be left with just x's, and then I can solve it. That's what we're going for here. It's much easier than trying to move the y over and using substitution. I never use substitution unless I have y equals or x equals something. Forget it. I'm not going to rearrange things. I can do this much more quickly. I add them together. 2x and an x, that's 3x equals that goes away. They cancel out right there. 5 plus 1 is 6. Divide by, boom, x is 2. Now to figure out the values, I'm going to go back to this top equation or this one. I'll just go right here. 2 times x, well we just discovered x was 2, plus a y equals 5. So 4 plus whatever y is equals 5. You and I can quickly see y is equal to 1. So I know that if I plug in 2 and 1 there, 2 and 1 there, it makes both the equations true. So our solution is x is 2, y is 1. Again, this is called elimination, to where we put two equations together to form a third equation, and we eliminate one of the variables in the process of doing it. There you got it.